People are often asking me which skills are required to find a job in Germany as software developer. And I will answer this question as short as possible because I've been through this process myself and I have a lot of things to tell. So, Alex, please make it short, make it short, please. Okay, let's go. In this video, we will briefly talk about what German companies expect from the relocated person which technical skills are needed for software developer to be relocated and which soft skills are required for software developer to find a job here. Yes, luckily German companies started to evaluate those soft skills of software developers. So first of all, let's describe the situation. We are speaking here when you are looking for job in Germany while not being in Germany, so living somewhere outside and not having a work permit. And now about relocation. Imagine German company which decided to relocate software developer from somewhere outside. This means that this company is ready to wait for you for at least three months until you settle all your things in your home country and prepare for relocation. This company is also ready to be your visa sponsor. And usually this means uh, some additional hassle for HR department and a bunch of additional paperwork. And they are also ready for the expenses related to relocation process. And from those facts come logical outcomes. This means that this company could not find local guys who fit the budget. In other words, they want more money. They expect that you will be effective immediately after coming to work. So nobody wants to teach you basics. And again, logically, you should be ready to work for salary less than salary on local market. So you probably might already understood juniors are not relocated, unfortunately. And first chances start to appear when you reach middle level of technical knowledge or senior one. And now a little bit about those mysterious middle senior levels of software developers. Frankly speaking, there is no clear explanation what does it mean. Everybody understands it from his own perspective. And I have also my own one. Middle developer means that you are effective within your team. And senior developer means that you are effective in a cross teams environment. That's it, as easy as that. If you want more details about my vision, I can make a separate video for you about it. And now about technical skills. First of all, of course, you need to know programming languages. Which one doesn't matter? You don't need to know all the nuances and hidden feature of the language. I will tell you more. Nobody will not even allow you to use those sophisticated approaches. You should know best and common practices how common tasks are usually being handled by this language. And believe me, it's not so hard to learn all those standard tasks. They are generally not too many, but it's expected that you will know them all. And the only thing which I can add to knowing the programming language is ability to write unit tests. And this automatically assumes that your code should be testable. Another thing I want to mention you should know as much as possible about what clean code is. If you don't know what it is, just go to Google and put what clean code is. And I have also left a pretty good summary about this concept in the pinned comment to this video. Another skill I want to add, you should be able to confidently work with Git. Believe me, the person who messes up with Git will make a lot of troubles to the whole team. You should know basics of Scrum. This is not mandatory, but at least basics. And also, it's very desirable that you know what is CI, CD. At least, what is it and what is the difference between these two. And now about soft skills. I'm preparing for the portion of hate, but on my opinion, soft skills are much more important for software developer than technical skills. And this rule applies not only to Germany, but to any country. Because you know what? Projects are dying not because somebody doesn't know how event loop is working in JavaScript. Projects are dying because of incompetent management, bad infrastructure and toxic atmosphere in team. All technical issues are generally solvable. So your main soft skill, don't be a dick. And communicate effectively and 
present effectively. You will be surprised, but 70% of software developers that I have interviewed cannot clearly explain in two sentences what their current application does. Or people with 10 years of experience cannot clearly explain what they can do and what they cannot do. So my advice to you, write those explanations on paper and learn them by heart. And smile more. Germans don't like gloomy people. And after that, the procedure of looking for IT job in Germany is pretty much standard. Good profile in LinkedIn, apply, 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 interview, 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 and prepare for the long run. Because technical interviews is a lottery, you cannot get prepared for them. The only thing which is matter, quantity, and a little bit of luck. And if you ever wondered how much money you need for relocation or for living in Germany, or for example, in particular in Munich, please watch one of the videos that you will see right now.